APA style requires both in-text citations and a references page. In-text citations are meant as quick references, while the reference page provides the full citation information for a source. As with many other styles you may be familiar with, in-text citations generally consist of the author's last name and the year of the source's publication. If you are using a direct quotation, you will also need to include a page number. This information usually appears in parentheses after the information that you've summarized, but can also be listed with the author and year at the beginning of a statement followed by a page number at the end. Note that the ending punctuation for the sentence, in this case a period, comes after the final parentheses. Everything that is cited in a paper must also be included in the references page which will come at the end of the paper. The references page serves as a complete listing of your sources that readers can use to find the sources themselves. A reference page should be formatted in the following way. List works in alphabetical order by the last name of the author, use double spaced text, indent all lines after the first line in a given entry, put the titles of longer works like journals and books in italics. The exact style of the citation will vary depending on the type of source being used. For example, books, journal articles, photographs, and videos are all cited differently. The most basic format is for a book with a single author. Author last name, initials, year of publication, title of work, location, and publisher. Another common source for research papers is a journal article. Last names and initials of authors, year of publication, title of article, title of journal, volume number, issue number, and pages. Most sources will follow a similar style of citation, but you should check with a style guide for directions on citing the specific type of source that you're using. There are many free tools and guides online to help you with citing your sources.